Right around. Oh, hit you! No, you didn't! Down on the ground! Down! Down! Jesus! Before traffic, we're pressing code. Get those hands up! That's the dance move right there, y'all. Go, 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 go! What's up everybody, Trooper J here, and I want to welcome you back to another episode of LSPDFR. Today I'm going to be doing a holiday patrol, going to be making sure that everybody is being safe during this holiday season, doing some proactive policing today. I don't know about you, but in my neck of the woods during the holidays, it gets crazy. I mean, people are drinking and driving, they're rushing, trying to get to where they need to get to. And today I just want to make sure that everybody is being safe, doing what they're supposed to do. And uh, hope you enjoy this episode. And with that being said, oh yeah, you know it, baby. Let's get it. Let's go. That's five dollars. Y'all, the thirteen central. Dispatch calling unit three, Robert twenty. Here we go. First call, driver under the influence. I'm gonna get caught up with this vehicle to uh, get this driver off the road before that driver injures him or herself or anyone else. I mean, this is gonna be a crazy shift. Three twenty four to central. Show me ten eighty four. I need to get caught up with this guy as soon as possible and get him off the road, especially with this kind of weather out here. Alright, there he is right there. Look at him swerving. Yeah, this guy, he's... Okay, he's picking up speed now because he know um, uh, that I'm after him. Oh man, luckily he didn't hit that man. And then he just blew through that red light. Whoa! He just 1050 into that vehicle! 324 to Central, request a call 3 assistance in Little Soul. Driver, step out of the vehicle! Step out of your vehicle! Get your hands up! Ah uh ah! -uh. Stop running! Get get down on the ground! Get down on the ground! Okay, Jay Daniels, do you have anything on you, sir? No, nah, man, I ain't got that, dummy. Hey, I got to go pee pee. Come on, man, I got to go. Ooh. Hey, blood stained rag. All right. All right, so I'm going to run a sobriety check on you to uh, see how much alcohol you have in your system. Let's see what comes back. Hoo wee! Point two six four percent. Oh yeah, he is lit. I guess he said he's gonna have a great holiday, getting drunk. Well, he could spend the rest of his nights in jail. Okay, he wants to pick up snow instead of putting him in the car. What do you want to do? Hit him in the back of the head with a snowball? Officer, I got the pee pee. Come on, man! I got to go. I feel it trying to trickle down my leg. You gotta hold it until you get to the station. Then you can go to the bathroom. Okay, I'm glad we got him off the road. All right, Mr. Daniels, follow me this way. There you go. All right, we got him off the street. One drunk driver off the street, at least. I'm glad I was able to get that guy off the street because he could have killed someone or himself. 
All right. Oh, oh no. Let, let me spin around here and uh, pull this car over. The vehicle's honking at me like I was in the wrong. Three twenty four to Central. I need to get a ten twenty eight on a felon two. Okay, the register owner is Susan White, and uh, her license is expired. Whoa, she just stops right there. Okay, uh, good thing she didn't hit that lady. All right, let me get her uh, pulled over up here. Show me 54 with that vehicle on Vespucci Boulevard. Hello, ma'am. How you doing today? Uh, the reason I pulled you over today is uh, you almost hit me back there. You happen to have your license, registration, and proof of insurance on you? Mm -hmm. Aren't you a tall glass of water? Okay. All right. Sit tight for me, Miss White. I'm sitting, baby, but not for long. Let's run her real quick. Okay, she's been stopped twice. Her license is expired. No active warrants. Okay. Everything is copacetic on her vehicle, but her license is expired, so she cannot drive. And there's a full open alcohol container. Ma'am, have you been doing any drinking today? Well, you know, it's the holiday. You know, I have to indulge a little, little here and there. Come on, baby. Okay, ma'am, do you do me a favor and step out of the vehicle? Ma'am, it's illegal to have an open alcohol container in your vehicle. I'm going to run a sobriety check on you to uh, make sure you haven't been drinking and driving. Ooh, yeah. 0.144%. For me. I need to smoke oh, man, this man. He picks up his phone. <laughs> That's crazy. Put your hands behind your back for me. You're under arrest for driving under the influence of alcohol. Ma'am, do you have anything on you that I need to be aware of? Any weapons, any drugs, or anything? No, I don't have nothing on me. Oh, 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 all right now. You better watch yourself now. Okay, she doesn't have anything on her. All right, ma'am, go ahead and hop in the back seat for me. All right, ma'am, go ahead and uh, have a seat in the back. Let's get this vehicle towed out of here. Three twenty-four to Central. I need to get a ten forty-six over here on Vespucci Boulevard. Tow truck should be here shortly. Oh, he just, she just hit me. Are you serious? Okay, I'm gonna go after this. Uh, oh man, this person is acting a fool. Oh my gosh. Oh my god, this person has to be on something. I, I tell you what, let me, uh, Thank you. I'm gonna back up and, uh, see if I can get in front of this vehicle to make sure that, uh, she can't take off. Driver, step out of the vehicle! Step out of the vehicle now! You better reach your hands for the heavens, because it's gonna take Jesus to get you out of this one. Get on the ground! Officer, officer, I'm in a hurry! I got places to be! Okay, here we go. Okay, what's her name? Sherna Broderick. Okay, uh, Miss Broderick, do you have anything on you, ma'am? No, I don't have anything on her. Let me search her. See if she has anything on her. 
Then I'm gonna see if she's been drinking. Oh wow, she has a bottle of moonshine grandma's recipe. That woo! Grandma's recipe. It ain't nothing like grandma recipe for stuff. Uh and car keys that have been used as Q-tip. Oh, just nasty. Okay, let's run a sobriety check on her to see how much alcohol she has in her system, if any at all. Let me run a drugalizer on her to uh, to see if she has any drug in her system. Oh my gosh, just it's just one big just disaster over here. Okay, she's negative there on uh, any narcotics in her system. Okay. Alright, I'm gonna get Linda's vehicle out of here and she's going to jail. There's a pursuit in progress just in front of me, so I'm gonna hurry up and get caught up with this vehicle to uh, get that driver off the road. I can't believe this guy is on a motorcycle in the snow. I mean, he's gonna hit something. Uh, see, oh man, see, that's why you don't need to be riding a motorcycle in this kind of weather. He just ran into the back of that vehicle. Okay, local air support is gonna help us in this pursuit, uh, just in case the guy gets away from us, the helicopter just can, can keep up with him. Oh man, we need to get this pursuit ended as quickly as possible. We've already had one accident with this with an officer on the motorcycle. He just 10 50 into the back of a vehicle. Although he popped up like Jack in the Box, he better go get himself checked out by EMS. Officer just rolled those two guys over. Oh my gosh. Wow. Oh man, he's gonna lose his job. He just mowed them over and kept going. Okay, let me uh I'm gonna have to check these guys out and and see if they are, are still alive. I highly doubt it though. Medical aid requested in Santiago Mountain Range. This has been a rough day. All right, EMS is right here showing up on the scene. Huh. I don't think they're going to be able to revive these guys. I, I think it's a wrap for them, to be honest with you. I mean, that officer was flying. Don't die on me. God, I hope what a mess. There's still hope. Ay, Dios. They're not even touching the body. <laughs> For the central, I need to get a 1078 over here on US Route 13. What in the world? Do you guys see that? They over there fighting. Ah oh, man, it's just been one thing after another today. Okay, coroner is going to be arriving on scene in just a moment for them. I got to break up this fight back here. Oh my gosh! He just bust that guy in the head with a shovel. Yeah, I'm he's coming back to me. Get, get, come back here! Get, get back here right now! What you running? Drop the weapon! Drop it! Heaven. Drop it! Drop the it! The only drop thing it, that I'm gonna drop right now is your man. I did not want to tase that guy, but he wouldn't drop it. You got drop you, it, drop you, it, you it, little pig! I'm gonna chop it. That's what you get, bro. 
Drop it now! Drop it now! What the heck is going on here? Get your hands up! Get your hands up! Get on the ground! Get on the ground! Gomer Colton. Let's see if he has any more weapons on him. Yeah. Okay. Let's go ahead and get him in the back of the car. I think all these other people over here are dead. Oh man, this is just a oh look at all these cops. This is just a nasty scene right here. Oh wow, he just ran into him. Alright, we're gonna get him in the back of the car. Get in the car and behave! All right, guys, that's going to do it for today's episode. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, smash that like button and subscribe to the channel. Until next time, Trooper J, out.